Hello and welcome to the Biomedical Microelectromechanical Devices course. I'm Tomasz Pordi, one of the lecturers, uh, originally uh, a biomedical engineer, and uh, I work at uh, uh, Toltec at Thomas Johann Sebeck Department of Electronics and the Department of uh, Chemistry and uh, Biotechnology. Uh, my colleague uh, Ot Scheler is uh, the co-lecturer he is uh, also from the, the Department of Chemistry and Biotechnology. And uh, what is this course about? BioMEMS devices or biomedical microelectromechanical systems uh, devices are uh, compact miniature devices for biological and chemical analyses. These are what uh, we will teach in this, uh, this uh, lecture. And I have here two examples that I brought. These are the ones that uh, you will also be working with uh, in the labs. These are 3D printed microfluidic chips and uh, they can be made uh, part of, uh, of a larger analytical system. These are uh, what are used for, uh, for transporting liquids inside uh, an analytical uh, setup. And uh, with 3D printing, you can uh, yourself uh, print and test in our laboratory uh, such devices. And uh, these all belong into the so-called lab on a chip device category where uh, these devices integrate analytical workflows uh, from sample to result in a single chip. And these novel chips promise to revolutionize uh, preventive medicine and uh, maintenance of uh, chronic medical conditions by uh, bringing medical grade analyzers closer to homes and local clinics, uh, reducing uh, tests uh, to, to result times and uh, the logistical chain connected to these. So what I hold in my hand is one uh, such compact device. This is a pocket PCR test, one of the first in the world, was developed by uh, uh, an Estonian German company uh, in a consortium of which uh, Taltec was part of. And uh, it, uh, this, this uh, device that I hold in my hand is for uh, analyzing uh, urine for uh, sexually transmitted diseases. And uh, it is a multiplex test. It detects two diseases from one sample and it works by means of uh, DNA amplification. And you will hear more about uh, all of these words during the lecture series. So if you participate uh, in this course, then uh, you, will, uh, you will attend uh, four modules. And in those four modules, there will be two, three lectures each. And uh, these modules cover uh, basic theoretical and practical aspects of, uh, of biomems and uh, more particularly lab on a chip. Um, it covers uh, uh, chip technology, uh, how to, to fabricate and uh, how to use these microfluidic chips. It covers electronic sensors and actuators used in biomems and uh, it covers networking of uh, electronic sensors and actuators. We also touch upon uh, topics such as uh, additive manufacturing and uh, other means of rapid prototyping, uh, wireless communication, finite element modeling, droplet microfluidics, digital microfluidics, and uh, the applications of, uh, of this uh, technology in bioanalytical fields. Uh, the first module is on basic theory and, uh, and, and elemental fabrication technology. Second lecture module is about uh, advanced uh, uh, theory, primarily fluid mechanics and uh, mass production. The, the third module is about sensors and actuators and uh, the networks of these. And then the fourth lecture is about applications of, uh, of this technology in uh, bioanalytical or chemical analysis settings. Uh, each of these modules will be ended by a seminar where uh, people present mini reviews of a chosen topic and uh, this will constitute 40 percent of the final score and to each uh, topic belongs a lab which uh, 
which constitutes in the form of a final report 60% of the score. So the emphasis is more on the practical work that you will be doing. In the practical works, you will go through a complete device design, uh, testing and verification workflow, uh, ending in, a, in an experiment um, of, uh, of uh, microfluidic mixing and, uh, and of measurement. And these devices that you design and test and simulate during the labs uh, will be 3D printed. So you will learn how to design them, you will learn how to uh, simulate uh, fluid mechanics, and uh, you will also learn some basic experimental methodology. And then in the end, you will uh, learn about uh, image analysis. Uh, and uh, finally, each year we have one or two guest lectures and uh, these are uh, invited lecturers from, uh, from research or industrial domains who are relevant to the topic of uh, Labonachip and Biomems and uh, they represent the cutting edge. Thank you.